How's it going everybody and welcome to another Crusader filled episode of Diablo 3. We're going to be doing a Torment Fiver of today. I believe I have... oh no, I don't really have any keys. Alright, so there we go. I was wondering if I had a Greater Rift key and I was like, I'm pretty sure I don't, which is why I decided to do a Torment 5 in the first place. Now I did get a new weapon that's... Stalgard's Decimator or whatever. It seems pretty alright. It rolled low on the affects, but oh well. You know, what can you do? Either way, I like it. It's a, It feels like a step up from... from my... Uh, what am I trying to talk about? From the uh, Scourge weapon. Or Scourge. However you want to say it. The Scourge weapon that I had. Feels like it's a step up, so... There's something positive about that, I suppose. That's always good. It's always good. It feels like I'm doing more more damage more consistently. And once again, like I, like I was talking about before, I'm not sure what it is about this game, but this game seems to just kind of like freak out. Like I'm not I'm not obviously I'm I'm online like recording and shit, but I mean this is this is ridiculous. Like I'm in I'm in yellow latency again. Look at this. Like it's not terrible, but could be better. Could be better, and I'm not sure what's going on. Who knows? I certainly don't. Alright. Yeah, but I seem to be taking care of things, like, faster. So, I mean, I'm not really going to complain there. What the fuck was that? Look at this! I'm, like, I'm rubber banding all over the place now. Okay. I guess whatever it was that I was fighting is, like, not dead? Is dead? Who knows? I don't know. I'm rubber banding, this game's doing weird shit. Whatever. It's going to do what it wants to do, I guess. It's going to do what it wants, because that's what always happens. In these situations. Oh, man. I don't know. You know I'm not sure if I'm asking for a whole lot. I just want, I want a decent connection, you know, when I'm when I'm playing my stuff, like not not even when I'm like playing with, with just people, but just in general, you know, it's really it's really ass backwards annoying. I'm just trying to get you know a simple thing done, and I can't get it done because you know our internet isn't being cooperative; it's being rather lousy for no reason whatsoever. Well, I mean, it's American internet, so I guess you know. It's lousy because, you know, all the cable companies say it can, you know, they, they're doing whatever they want. They're doing whatever they want, essentially. It's just like, eh, you know, we'll just, we'll throw out all your data for no reason whatsoever. Just to piss you off. Alright, there's a goblin there. Cool, and it's dead. Uh, wow, this portal's staying open for a while. There we go. There we go, let's not even bother with this trash here, look. That's how much it's lagging. Oh great, we're in red now. We're in red lag. Red lag's so cool, guys. I mean, you always want to be at your shittiest when you're doing something, you know, sort of semi-important, right? Sort of semi-important. Look at this, where are we at? 931 milliseconds, what the fuck? Seriously, what the hell? <laughs> what kind of service are we even paying for? Like, what What the hell? What is this? I mean, this is like, just complete bullshit. Uh, whatever. As long as we get through this rift, I'll, I'll, I'll be fine. You know? As long as we get through it, I'll be, I'll be good. Be right as rain. Is this annoying? Yes. Is the end of the world? No. Some people would say it might as well be, though. Eh, they're not totally wrong. I mean, at this point, we shouldn't even be having this these problems. You know, like, as, as America, as a nation that is supposed to be leading, you know, be one of the leaders as far as technological advances in the world. And stuff. Just technology in general. 
you know, it's kind of pathetic how we are, like, I think ranked like 27th or lower as far as our internet speeds and our prices uh, because companies are greedy fucking assholes, pretty much. It's like, oh yeah, you know, like, 10 down, not even a... Not even a megabyte upload? How about, like, $50 a month or something, you know? Like, really stifling innovation and, you know, just fairness. It's pathetic and it's sad. And it's all, it's all because of greed, too. It's all about greed. Just gotta keep the American people down and we'll force them to... You know, we'll force them to pay the prices that we want. And then pretty much not give them a choice, so they have to go with us. And thus the Monopoly train keeps going, because we don't have a choice. We don't have very many internet companies. We have, like, maybe... Well, two major ones. Obviously, uh, Time Warner and... Uh, what was it? Comcast. I mean, there's also Cox, I think. Verizon, AT&T, CenturyLink, but I mean really, there, there's only two. It's Time Warner Cable and and uh, Comcast. I mean, Google Fiber is here, and CenturyLink does have some gigabit services, but it's not anywhere near where I live, and I think also... Verizon has some fiber optic services, but um, it's also limited. Also quite limited, so... I don't know. Either way, a majority of the internet uh, service is split between Time Warner Cable and Comcast, which is uh, really shitty because they are both... They are two shitty companies that are attempting to merge to make this even you know, an even greater nightmare for the American people. And if that happens, if, you know, the FCC allows that to happen, then, well, we're just, we're fucked. You know, really. It's it's great that, you know, this land of uh, freedom and opportunity isn't really a land of freedom and opportunity. It's a land for freedom and opportunity if you're rich. I guess it's got that going for it. But that's about it. If you if you aren't rich, if you're not in the one percent, you are pretty much not going to make it. As unfair and as cynical as that sounds, it's the fucking truth. I wish it weren't, but you know, if you're not part of the one percent, well, no one gives a shit about you. <laughs> that's just uh, that's just kind of how it goes. That's kind of how it goes. As sad as that is. It's a sad truth that, you know, you will learn eventually. <laughs> Not a very good thing. This wasn't even something that I was really going to talk about. I think I think just because of <laughs> that spawn off of shitty internet. But, I mean, that doesn't make it any less true. Not that I want to bring people down by watching this, but... You know, it just it pisses me off. It's annoy It annoys me to no end that this is... This is the time that I live in, you know. I can I, I can be as mad as I want, and I I'm, I always am generally that, you know. This was not the world. I've said this before when talking to friends, but this is not the world that I was promised. That I would, uh, yeah, you know, that I was promised when I was growing up. Now, obviously, you know, some of that was a pipe dream, and obviously things change. But I mean, they didn't have to change like this. Like, this has gone for the worst. And this was, like... Like, some of the change was inevitable, but a lot of it was preventable. And, you know, just because of the right people, or the wrong people in the right places and all that stuff, uh, this is the world we live in right now. And it's kind of an unfortunate thing. It's a very unfortunate thing. Like, I mean, yesterday we just had... Okay, now I'm not even... Oh, great. Yeah, what 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 am I at now? 1796 milliseconds latency. Are you fucking kidding me? 
1852. Holy shit. What the fuck? What is this? Fuck it. I'm not I'm not even dealing with that shit. Not even dealing with. It. Let's just let's just do this. Jesus Christ. This is insane. This should not be a problem. <laughs> it is a problem. It shouldn't be a problem, but you know, whatever. Whatever. It's great. It's great because you know, we're just uh things continue to get worse. They don't get better because people the people that want change who see that we need change uh, are in the minority unfortunately there are too many there's too much corruption too many people with their with their hands and and money in other people's pockets you know making making all the crucial decisions to push their agenda and uh, Great. I'm gonna sit here and I'm gonna take damage for no reason. I'm gonna waste all of that because my internet keeps being fucking stupid. And yeah, that's that's just uh, that's the long or short of it, really. I mean, yesterday we had we had a uh, state elections, I think. And I know it's probably not so much a big deal for a bunch of people, which apparently it wasn't, but. You know, there's that whole, like, discussion about Amendment 2 and, you know, legalizing medical marijuana. And there, you know, regardless of what you personally believe, you know, there have been s numerous studies done and results shown that, you know, li use of medical marijuana can help people with, with certain problems. And the funny thing is... The voting for for success, which was kind of stupid, because you would think that a majority vote would win, but it needed to be a specific majority amount to win, which was dumb. And unfortunately, that fell through. 57% voted yes, 43% voted no. In order for the amendment to pass, we needed 60%. We needed a 60% majority to win. And, you know, apparently there are 3% of people in Florida that was just like, nope, nope, not not going for it. Medical marijuana, marijuana, that's fucking drugs. We're not doing that. We're not doing that. People are just going to smoke fucking pot all the time and, you know, blah, 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 whatever. And it's like, not really. Like, you can kind of, you can regulate that, obviously, if it's for medical usage, like, like, the thing, I'm not saying that having access to drugs would lower the percentage of people, like, using it or something, or maybe it would, I don't know. Like, I think the reason a lot of people do what they do is because they're like, no, you can't do this, it's bad. And so, yeah, obviously more people are going to be like, alright, well, we're just going to, you know, fuck the system. We're just going to defy that shit. And then they go ahead and they do what they do, you know? They they use it for, you know, and I mean, miracle, like, marijuana, come on. Like, it's marijuana. That is not, that is probably the least of your problems. It's the least of your problems. It's, like, less worse than fucking cigarettes or alcohol. I mean, really, like... We, we have less to worry about and or gain from stopping people from recreational or even medicinal use of marijuana. Really, like, it's just, it's so, it's so incredibly stupid. Like, the, <laughs> I don't know, would, would I say it's like the agenda people are pushing? Maybe, but, you know, the oversight on this thing is just, it's ridiculous. It's ridiculous, it's stupid, and, well, you know. Either way, it didn't pass. And a lot of people were pissed about it. You know, all we needed was 3% more, and I believe the amount of people voting was like 5 point something million. 5.5 million, maybe even. And so, 57% of that 5.5 million, approximately, rounded, was like, yeah, we should totally do this, because there are, ben there are benefits to this thing. And then 40% 43%. I, was, I don't know why I said 47. I can't count. But 
43% was like, nope, fuck those people. And so here we are. <laughs> oh, man. Long rant is long, and I got some shitty items. So that's it for me. Hope you enjoyed. Unfortunately, that was filled with lag, which I apologize for. But, oh well. See you on the next one, guys.